this is Dustin with New Game Plus, and this is our retro game of the week, Diablo 2. Now that's the title, Diablo 2. Came out in the year 2000, of course, by Blizzard. We've played Diablo as a part of the podcast already, and I surprisingly enjoyed it thoroughly. Afterwards, I enjoyed it so much that the guys encouraged me to get Diablo 2, because 10 times better, right? We can play together. And I hated the experience. But I think I may have just hated it because they were rushing around. They knew the game. They were very familiar. I was just running around behind them, killing the leftover mobs and picking up the Good leftover day. items. Good day. And uh, But I continued playing solo after that. Really enjoyed the single-player immersion in Diablo 1. Hadn't played, haven't done anything in Diablo 2 outside of that one experience with them and then uninstalled. So I'm interested to try it this week. Uh, it is a game and an episode that we're doing in honor, honor of one of our producers, one of our late producers who just passed away. It is Zion. Uh, and so uh, feel free to listen to episode 175 as we make that announcement, 176 as we play Diablo 2 and uh, do a whole episode in tribute to Zion. Um, this is on PC and it's dark and I've got lights shining in my face. So I'm going to do my best to see. This guy's come up to me. What's his name? Warriv? And with an exclamation mark over his head, and he continues to say, Good day. I, that was wonderful. I didn't make him do that. Um, so I'm going to click on him, but first I want to show you my character. I'd already... It's like a lengthy uh, scene to begin the game. There's inventory. I'm just pressing buttons. C. All right, there we go. I chose a necromancer. Um, I'm actually... I will get the, uh, the expansion pack. It's uh, LOD, Legend of... Dark Arena of Time, what is it, Legend of Darkness League of, I don't know, something of, of D. And I, I will play that, but I wanted to do the raw, uh, no expansion first. So, uh, I only had a few choices like Barbarian and uh, some kind of wizard type thing, a Paladin, I don't know, Spear Person. I chose Necromancer, it's out of the ordinary, but I thought it'd be fun. Named him Good Asher, day. Good day. I am level 1. Haven't done anything else, so let's. Uh, looks like I've got four pots down here. Also, minor healing potions. Let's try to get through one quest. Oh, greetings, stranger. I'm not surprised to see your kind here. Many adventurers have traveled this way since the recent troubles began. No doubt you've heard about the tragedy that befell the town of Tristram. Well, some say that Diablo, the Lord of Terror, now I'm remembering. walks the world again. Tristram was the town in the first game. I don't game. know if I believe that. But a dark wanderer did travel this route a few weeks ago. It was headed east to the mountain pass guarded by the rogue monastery. Maybe it's nothing, but evil seems to have trailed in his wake. You see, shortly after the wanderer went through, the monastery's gates to the pass were closed, and strange creatures began ravaging the countryside. Until it's safer it's outside the camp and the gates are reopened, I'll remain here with my caravan. I hope to leave for Loot Gulane before the Loot shadow that fell Gulane. over Tristram consumes us all. If you're still alive, then, I'll take you along. You should talk to Akara, too. Akara. She seems to be the leader of this camp. Maybe she I'll talk to Akara. More. So, if, if I remember correctly, at the end of Diab Diablo 1, uh, you defeat Diablo, but I think the idea is that he possessed your character, and now your character is this crazy wanderer. I don't know. Um... So left click is moving around, not right in town. Right click is attacking. Asher I says do that here. he's not going to do that in town. Kasha. Welcome, Outlander, to our glorious hovel. I wonder I if there's a quick to way to... Driven us from our... Okay, so the... yes? if you click, you don't find out... Oh, Welcome, sh... Outlander. Can I speed Welcome, that up? Out... Welcome. Welcome, Outlander, to our glorious hovel. I, if I if Welcome I'm trying I'm trying a lot of things in it hovel. I think whatever what's the gossip Reed is a pig I've been tempted to throw him out of the camp many times but Charcy seems to think that His he's names. good company I don't trust the man Key Charcy what's your name Kasha Wariv the, you know what I'm playing I'm playing Dungeons and Dragons that's what I'm playing Dungeons and Dragons right now um uh, all right where's a map M is message log. Tab is map. All right. Uh, Akara, down there. Can I click on? Nope. See, uh, and Gide's up there. He's a selfish boar or hog or something. Uh, I wanted to. 
Rogue encampment waypoint. I believe those are the transporting Greetings. locations. Akara. I am Akara, high priestess of the Sisterhood of the Sightless Eye. That's ridiculous, I and I love it. The high priestess the of the Sisterhood of the Sightless Eye. Within these rickety walls. Roll a d20. Let's you see. Our ancient sisterhood has fallen under a strange curse. The mighty citadel from which we have guarded the gates to the east for generations has been corrupted by the evil demoness Andariel. <laughs> I still can't believe it. Andariel. She turned many of our sister rogues against us Kay. and drove us from our ancestral home. Now the last defenders of the sisterhood now are either dead or scattered throughout the, the wilderness. I implore you, stranger, please help us. I will. Find a way to lift this terrible curse and we'll pledge your loyalty. Stranger, please help us. There's right. a place of great oh. evil in the wilderness. Kasha's rogue scouts have informed me that a cave nearby is filled with shadowy creatures. Gotta go find a cave. From beyond the grave. I fear that these creatures are massing for an attack against our encampment. If you are sincere about in helping us find if the dark labyrinth and destroy the fell beast. That? Okay. Okay. Quest log. Q. I believe so. Did I do it right? Den of Evil. Look for the den in the wilderness outside of the rogue's camp. So I'm in the rogue's camp now. I've got to look for the den of wilderness. Um, all right. Before we do that, I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, Raise skeleton. I guess that's an ability I have. Reanimate skeletal warrior from target corpse. Because I know I'm not going to be like a physical melee attacker. Um, I, I think I've got to raise those skeletons to fight for me. Open mini panel. So that's character. Inventory. I'm working with a wand. And a s <laughs> two scrolls. Um, skill tree. Do I have any skill points? I do not. Is, what is we start at the top, it looks like. Yeah, first level. So good. At first, I don't even get a choice. I'm just going to have to choose that Amplified Damage. Which seems like it's probably a passive. Alright, I know I'm taking a lot of time. Um, but I think that's good, right? Uh, now, uh, looks like we're going down south. Is this the right way? It, look, cause it looks like the rogue encampment is... Uh, I mean, we've got a wall all the way across, so... Maybe I should purchase some armor? Do I even have any... Money? Uh... Oh, it would be in my inventory. <laughs> no. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> Alright. Entering the blood more. All who oppose me, beware. Looks like I can battle now. Okay really nervous I uh, just want like one bad guy the atmospheric music in this game people that know this game right now are like what are you doing this is simple like go here what are you what are oh, the fallen? Um, I think I have to be close to you, right? I I don't know how to attack you. Normal attack. Normal attack. Please attack. Oh, I just have to left click. All right, I'm gonna raise dead you. Raise dead you. Oh no no no. Okay, so we're keeping this here. I've got to put that on hotkeys. F1. Tell me how I can put this on a hotkey, somebody. Uh, acting like I'm in a live stream right now. We're going to put this bad boy on a hotkey. Um, I don't know. That window is so big. Skill. No, 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 no. Or maybe skill tree. Let's try skill tree. No. No. How do I use it without... Sorry guys, this is rough. Um, I need to use... I did it. Oh, only one at a time. 
Let's go. Fight. I did it. Okay. Nice. Let's continue. This little skeleton. Can we name him? I want to name him like... Kenny? Ronald. Ronald! I bet you don't stay alive long, do you? I need to raise a second. Ronald's tough. Ooh, first drop. Three gold. I'm going to be rich before long. But come back, Ronald. Ronald. Freaking Ronald just running off. Ronald, get back here, please. Let me control you. Ron... I mean, I'm just going to... This is the gameplay. I'm just going to follow Ronald around while he... Ronald. Chill. Oh my gosh, you're moving to... <laughs> Ronald. I had to get rid of Ronald. Now I got Jeffries. Alright, Jeffries. We're looking for... An enc... Scroll of Identify. Oh. There's also should be a hotkey that uh, shows me any loot. Like, it just highlights the loot that's around so that I can pick that up. It's back there. Uh, Jeffries, what did you just kill? A quill rat? I need to go back to attack. I, I don't... Jeffries, none of these guys listen to me. Jeffries. Dead rogue? Can I search this dead rogue? I scroll of what do I got I got just scrolls scrolls on scrolls listen Jeffries please I'm gonna find this cave it doesn't look like <sighs> alright no cave we're gonna go back over here to the to the uh, left or what do you oh okay so Jeffries is up here He's level one. So this is a lot like Diablo 2, except immediately, sorry, a lot like Diablo 1, except in Diablo 1, I went almost immediately into that church thing. I, get, I bet I could hit him also. Yeah, that would be helpful. Um, shift? I wonder what shift does. Shift. Oh, ooh. They're scary. Nice. Jeffries and me make a good team. I mean, I just strike out at air while Jeffries fights everybody. Alright, Quill Rat. Nice. One hit. I'm so strong. Am I seeing any... <gasps> oh, just another bridge? Alright, I should... Zombie? Oh, you're tougher. I don't think I'm supposed to go over here yet. Let's look at this quest again. Look for the realm outside of the rogue's camp. Yeah, I don't. Th I think that's gonna be too far. Look at me using my intuition. Um, but I don't know. What is that? No. There also has got to be a way to raise two without killing off one. So my, my tactic was to go along this barrier to s What is that? Maybe I'll go see what that is. But first let me... I was going to go around the barrier to see if there's an entrance to a cave. I also don't know... Something's... T something... Something's telling me... Th oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no, that's like house stuff. Something's telling me that... Some of this is procedurally generated. A light man up. Okay. Heck yeah. Inventory management is a huge thing in this game that I just remembered. Let's identify. I don't even care. Scroll of identify. Show me what these gloves are. That's. All right. Uh, so let's use this on this. Plus one dexterity. Let's equip. We got some gloves. We got some bolts that I'm not really going to be able to use. Where do we put that? No. Here. Get back there. Uh, we're still good. Health is a little low. Jeffries. Did you die? Uh, I've got to raise another. 
Jeffrey's left me. We're gonna go over here. I, is that blue for a reason? Wow, it's so dark. There's also this. Please tell me I can reanimate Cal. Well. Hel health. Okay, okay. So, on the mini-map, I'm not seeing any caves, so we're going to go across this other bridge. So I don't have to keep clicking rapidly. It looks like I can hold left click and move. As we travel across this southern bridge, I will say this. Maybe I can reanimate that zombie. Reanimate a reanimated creature. Or maybe he's not even around anymore. Uh, all right. We need to get in a fight. Now I don't have someone on my side. Uh, let me give you my thoughts on the game currently. I would, I would have, I wanted to finish a quest, but I've gone so slow, so dreadfully slow. But that's how I like to take these games. Um, and you're along for the ride. I, I like it so far. Um, it's very, very similar to. The first game in the series except I'm a stamina shrine the weight of the world seems uh, it's like a temporary boon or uh, not boon temporary good thing let's uh, let's yeah nice why did he die It looks like I leveled up. All right. Oh. I don't even know where to go for there. New skill. Let's start there. We've got to start with amplified damage before we go to one of these other areas. So let's learn amplified damage. And let's get out of here. And then where am I even going to place? I know that I'm supposed to specialize here probably. I haven't looked up anything, and I don't know what each of these do. Obviously, strength is not going to be necessary unless that is weight limit. Vitality is health. We're going to get that up a few. Where are my points? I have three remaining. Energy is mana, I would assume. Dexterity. Why do I need dexterity? It's high. Attack rating. And defense. We're going to do that. That, that might have been a really bad idea. Um... I want to reanimate. There we go. I think that's a good place to call it. I know I didn't even find like the cave to where I was going. Uh, but I did level up to level 2. So that's saying something. This cave was supposed to be right out... What was that? Oh! Oh! Guys. The Den of Evil. Come back. I, I didn't even name this guy. What am I getting myself into? Uh, the, the Den of Evil? Is that what? The Den of Evil? Quest? <gasps> Look for the wilderness outside the rogue's camp. Perfect. I found the Den of Evil. I know that you wish that you could continue to play along with me, but it's been about time. And so I'm going to have to call this uh, the first play. Let's go in, Gerald. Geraldine. This is a girl. I Kill all the monsters in the den. Within this place. So I'm going to continue to play. Um, I gotta do this or Geraldine's gonna be running around like crazy. Uh, I, I'm gonna like it. I already know. A single player is the way to go on this for me. I am gonna get the, uh, expansion pack, uh, League of Doom. I think that's LOD. And, uh, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Play along with this this week. Send in your thoughts on Diablo 2 to ngppodcast at gmail.com. Or, uh, you can go on our Discord channel, which you can find that link on all of our socials. Uh, and there's a commentary channel there. Or, you can go to our website, ngppodcast. <laughs> ngppodcast.com and uh, go to the contact portion send us in your thoughts on the game we'll include it as a part of our podcast episode next week episode 176 Diablo 2 thanks for hanging out uh, with my first play here uh, see you soon let's go Geraldine to battle <laughs>